That's good to hear. Give me a little more intel. What's your grief? Well, it uh, would be better to... Let me guess. Salt, right? You know me well. Uh-huh. See you soon. Stay here in camp. I want patrols every half hour, reporting directly to me. Are we preparing for me, a bit? You're here. What is he doing here? I forbade you from even breathing on that Militech convoy, so you call in your friend to do it all behind my back? Is that it? Uh huh. That's exactly why I had V come and stand Got right. Got no in. fucking clue what's going on here. Damn it to hell, Saul. Are you seriously considering letting that basilisk slip through our fingers? I am. But a chance like this. A chance of what? Rotting up the job we came here to do? We're pissing Militech off, so they hammer us into the dirt right here. Shit! Pan Am, can you please tell him? I've already tried. Let it go, Mitch. The Biotechnica people will be here in an hour. Try not to cock anything else up before then. I can't believe it. Look, there he goes, off to paint the grass green. What's this basilisk nonsense? It's an armored Militech cargo panzer. Junk from back in 2060 or so. They want to pedal it off to a backwards country, somewhere it can still pass as a technological wonder. The Militech convoy will take the 101 right past us. Shame not to say hello. Is this basilisk worth another fight with Saul? Yes. A craft like that would finally put us back on the right path. The family is falling apart. If we fall into this Biotechnica rut, no one will ever take us seriously again. Okay, so you do want to go behind Saul's back, and drag me here specifically for that. Cassidy, Ted, Carol, and Bob also on board. And you plan to grab the Basilisk how? Thanks, V. Haven't said I'd help just yet. Okay, let's go talk to the rest. What a damn shame. Uh, what about Washington's ancient history? Okay, so what the hell else do you have? So, just the four vets on board asshole. with the plan. Nobody and else? You. We didn't bother asking the others. There was too great a risk someone would take it to Saul. Besides, only the vets understand what we have to gain by having a basilisk. Sounds pretty risky to me. On the contrary, easy as pie. There won't even be much security on the convoy. Plus, we'll be doing our part towards furthering the cause of world peace. Why should this beast wind up being used in some little third world skirmish? We'll make better use of it right here in America. Did you try to get Saul on board again? No luck, huh? No. Okay, everyone listen. Militech will transport the Basilisk in parts distributed across two trucks. Wait, do I sense a quiver in your voice? Fuck you! The convoy will halt at the railroad crossing on the 101. We'll attack from behind, then get the hell out and away. Questions? Comments? Motions? Nice job, Sunshine. Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm in. Hmm. Okay. Thanks. First, we'll ride to the station. The train engine we need to block the convoy's way is there. Are you riding with us, or will we meet you there? Riding with you. Excellent. Let's get going. I think I heard a little shake in that voice. You did not. Ah, uh, come on. Did 
you get your hands clammy too? Screw you. But are you sure you didn't leave any tracks? Militech won't notice a thing. Are you trying to insult me, Bobby? Okay, okay. Forget I even had. like it so much, maybe we should just hijack the train. Let the Basilisk go on its way? Yeah, then just drive this beast to the 101. Bear him back. Sol would be on board with that. Are we ready? Okay, the Militech convoy will be traveling from Night City to the base where they're due to meet the buyer. We will stop it at the railroad crossing. All we have to do is shove this beauty in its way. V, any questions? Plan to move this thing how, exactly? It's old tech. Carol will have to hack it. Then I'll somehow have to finagle authorization from the control tower to move it. The tower looks inactive to me, too. Yeah, we'll see to that. You and Pan Am just get the authorization code. Okay. Let's get to work. Junctions. Yes, those. When you see them from above, you feel... Free. Like you could set off on a thousand journeys all at once. Perhaps more simply... Hopeful. Sure thing. Not here. Not here. Some sort of Stone Age control panel. Got something. Good job. Carol! We have a card! What now? You have to put it in the reader! Well, V? The card in the reader? <sighs> Here goes nothing. Come look! 
little engine that could. V, I wanted to speak with you. Missed you. Pretty bad. Oh, well, this means... Oh, wait, just, just wait. This is not how we usually talk. No time like the present. Okay, go ahead. That was a joke. Listen, V, I believe I know where this is going. And not to your liking? No, it's not that. I also wish to talk about it, just not so openly. My plan was to tiptoe around, test the waters, then retreat back into my shell. Okay, but let's skip the tiptoeing. Where are we now? I would not want to cut this up. So far, so good, champ. Because I've kept my mouth shut up to now. The thing is, I usually act before I think. Uh-huh, noticed. I know. But I also need impulses to act upon. When I do something spontaneously, I feel I'm being honest. Yet with you, I prefer to play it safe. Why is it any different with me? Because I truly care this time. Yet I fear I'll do or say something foolish and be left alone in the desert. I would rather keep you close. If only as a friend. Try following the impulse next time. Okay. Well, in any case, you've been warned. All right. Let's rejoin the others. Convoy. Got eyes and ears on it? Yes. Carol checks their communication channels from time to time. Everything is proceeding as planned. For now.
your ass down a minute, honey. Breathe. Everything's under control. The convoy is already heading our way. You worried about Saul? First person ever to stand up to Saul. Ah, oh, save your breath. I don't need to be consoled. Ah. Was it someone I know? New. Scorpion. You came home from the war, head full of new ideas and a host of new contacts. He tried to get Saul to lead us in joining Snake Nation. It would make us stronger, he said. I don't think he peeped a word of it to me. What did Saul do? Saul dressed the guy down head to toe for messing with the family. Hell, he didn't send him on any jobs for a year. Gee, really consoling. Thanks. You said yourself you didn't need any. I'm gonna try and get some sleep. Okay. It'll be quite some time before the convoy comes through. Kind of go out here. Not true, but this is nice. Catch some shit eye with me. I'll just lie here a while, by your side, gazing at the stars. Is that another area of your expertise? Got maps of the heavens in your library, too? Of course. That's the Big Dipper. And do you see the small flickering star to the right? Uh, yeah. You do? Oh, dear. That means there's a major leak. Good night, B. Is everyone ready? Let's ride, V.
Mitch, Bob, go! All is planned, boss. All right, the train's leaving. You'd better move. Okay, let's go. Ready to roll. Sure did. Just be happy you won't be around to put the hunk of junk together. The real fun is just starting for Mitch and Teddy. Lost the Militech channel. The suits finally realized someone was listening and changed the codes. <laughs> Perfect timing, if you ask me. No, thank you. I'll take care of this myself. Fuck! Pan Am! So it begins. What's the meaning of this? Exactly what you see. The Basilisk. All I see is two trucks with giant Militech logos on them. Fuck, Pan Am! You can see them from miles away! You think we don't have problems enough on our hands? The Raffins could rear their heads at any moment. And now we have Militech to worry about, too. Stop it! Fuck! Just shut up already! Do you want to serve corporations forever? Fine! Go right ahead! In that case, we'll leave the Basilisk as a souvenir of what this family used to be. Or you know what? Maybe next time we're attacked, we'll be able to fight back! As soon as I'm done with Biotechnica, we call a family meeting to discuss this. Discuss you. Until that time, I want these trucks out of my sight. And the Basilisk? Can we put it together? Do what you want. Just get out of my sight. Bob, Mitch, you two take the trucks around back. We need to unload. Sure, but then what do we do with them? Oh, I've got an idea. You got quite a pair of lungs there. Thanks. I believe the last time I pulled something like that, I was 10 years old. Seem to still be in fine working order. You need me again, all you gotta do is call. V. I'm sure I will, so you better expect that call. Be waiting. Take care.
Lawrence. Rachel, the uh, passion project, BD. Oh, yeah. What's up? We've got a crisis on our hands. Could really use your help. Stevenson's had a breakdown, you? nothing any yeah, shrink can do about it. Can you Precisely. come here to the studio just to talk to him? What can we do? I know, I know. Fine, sure. On my way. He said he'll come. Thanks, V. V, welcome to Pacifica. Pretty quick on the dial. Just got here. That's the biz. Be in touch. On high alert now. I lost contact with a vehicle somewhere in your area. Thanks. Eyes peeled. Six? <laughs> I'd say I'm sitting at a strong six. I guess we both know what's going to happen next. Delamine misses you. I'm here to shut you down. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. 
really appreciate it if you didn't make this difficult. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. I'm going to kill you. And all the cake is gone. You'd fall for that. Okay, that's enough. Hail the sacro You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four, and it'll be for you. Killing Actually, don't. Oh, I'll save you the trouble. It's still my oh. Let's safety those weapons, Napoleon. It turns out most humans are surprisingly fragile. And surprisingly vocal about how fragile they are. Going back to Delamine really so scary. You gotta drag this out. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. A bitter, unlikable loner whose passing shall not be mourned. Enough. What's your point, anyway? Survival? You're still shuffling around a little. But believe me, you're dead. How do you... The talking is over. I'm going back. I've made contact with the missing vehicle. Definitely the oddest of the bunch. Yes. Particularly impertinent, that one. A share of your fee is being processed.
Zoli était posé avec la paix. Tout le monde ici là, tu connais Michel. Il était dénié dans nous, tu t'es songé la vie sous il là. You are V, we have been waiting. He gave me away. It's the hair, isn't it? We have had eyes on you since you entered Pacifica. Make sure I didn't get lost. Where we got this, sir? My contact? Someone finally gonna tell me about this job? I'm just a man in the middle. You will learn more. Soon. No. Wanna talk with Brigitte? She here somewhere? Uh, no. Shopping center by the intersection. Go to the butcher shop there. Ask for Placy. He will tell you the details. In nouveau zil noir. Looking for proceed. Lassi. Garde ici là. C'est où même? Continuez. Lassi. Garde là. You proceed. Proceed. thought selling domesticated fowl was still illegal. Six years, poultry supposedly had the plague. Now, all of a sudden, poof, it's clean? This is not for sale. What do you want? You know, I heard a few things about you. Mm. The voodoo boys. Best runners in town. At least that's what they say. Though nobody really knows what you do on the net. This is good. I mean, bleeding edge black soft, corporate data heists, waging war on Netwatch, but no one mentions chickens. Told me at the chapel you're the one to talk to? Mr. Han sent me. Said you got murk work needs doing. No here. Come with me. We headed. A hotbed of controversy. A city Tune within a city. This way. Tune in a villa. Pacifica. Welcome to Pacifica. You know Pacifica well? Nah. You guys aren't exactly great at rolling out the welcome mat for outsiders. Was to be its own city where suits were burned and it is a close circle. The cops feed the ship, they spit the cash back out. All the toys here are gone from over cash. The twist is now in the GIM, the Grand Imperial Mall. Pacifica's biggest, ugliest temple to build, but never finished. Until last week, it was deserted, empty. But now? The animals crawled in, made a nest. Okay, my pal Vinny Peter. Don't we? 
période de vérité est perdue de Anton. Doretta. Placide, petite mère. Mami! Pour pas de besoin. Il y a l'autre qui gagne les pis mal. Mais ça c'est pour ma bonne langue pour une réponse. Merci. Let's go. That's far now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's Animal before? Yeah, a few times. You want the animals out of the gym? Extinct? Is that why you hired me? You learn everything soon. I mean, it makes no sense them being here. Middle of Pacifica, no backup, cut off. Your turf. Hell, even badges don't patrol around here. Uh huh. They're trying to provoke you? Make you do something stupid? They do not leave G.I.M. How many are we talking about in there? Daddy, maybe more. Vinina, we talk here. You sit. When do I see Brigitte? You do job. That is first. What the hell? You could fucking tell me what you plan to do first. You take job. You do what I say. So you chuck in now. Damn it. Here goes nothing. Well, at least he's not likely to talk your ears bloody. Evelyn Parker. Ring a bell? Not one of us. She did work for you once. Why not send your own goons to the gym? It's not our way. How's that been working out for you? Work good, good more than bad. Your comb shaman, it is Victor. You two know each other? No, no need. This hardware is shit, you should replace. Oh, so now you're a ripper doc too. Is that at all relevant, or just a cheap scare tactic? I need you to be able. I need no. This chip, it have no signature. What is it? Chip's why I'm here. Why I want a word with Brigitte. Doesn't look at all familiar. It should. Why? I see only it is damaged. Got a bullet to the brain, hasn't worked since. That's how. Hmm. Once inside, what do I do? The communet. Twenty thirty-five zero seven. Three seconds before, poof. We try to learn where the communet come from. Van's definitely a custom job. I see you not know also. Hey, just trying to piece the facts together. Tech looks pretty advanced. Doesn't scream meathead to me. They watch it very close. It is important, whatever I do. Placid. Batman Kelly up this and I'll Femme Portra. Time for a break? Think you might be needed. They will manage fine. You focus. Animals aren't the play here, are they? They're hired muscle, someone else needed them. Someone with a van full of Netrunner tech. And that's where I come in? To sniff out who? Mm -hmm. Start with the communet. Hide from all eyes. Only see the city as you. But but now seeing what it is so hard with, with our subnet. Why? What for? You are, you are my vessel now. now. Do not see what, see what you, you see. see. Hear what, what you hear. hear. I will, I will guide, guide you to G.I.M. Another voice in your head. Just what the Ripper Doc ordered.
We know who the runner inside is? What he wants? Is I hope you tell me. So, aim to keep an eye on me. <laughs> Shows trust. All right. Anything else I should know? Find our people near Mall. They will show you how to get inside the beast. My pay. How much we talking, and how am I gonna collect? And say you not in this for cash. You in this for problem. Do GIM for us. Brigitte can solve it. Uh huh. Except then I found out you need me to be a bullet trap on enemy turf. That means my fees just gone up. Mm, we will see. No promise. Got it. So I do this, and you put me in front of Brigitte, right? Yes. Suti at the end of the hall. Go down, my people will let you pass. We are done. None too fond of strangers here, are you? People like you. Stick out. Meaning, I best watch it? Mm-hmm. Wise. What? I check stability. The link on your end there. Mm -hmm. Seems so. Fucking peace. And most importantly, a next gen brain dance reason. 